Institute of Medical Sciences, Banaras Hindu University is a place for young medical students to learn the art and science of medicine. And inside this grand institute is a library that provides them with a vision and place to carve themselves and get ready to cure and heal the sufferings of humanity. The IMS library is situated at the center of the institute comprising a number of rooms. Some of them have books from authors around the world and some of them designated as reading rooms for students to bring their own notebooks and have some great hours of attentive study. Apart from it, there is also a journal and thesis section. It's rightly said by someone that your life is complete if you own a garden and a library. Have you ever experienced the silence that penetrates our skin and reaches inside nourishing our cells? That is the kind of calmness that a library has. It has a million words to say and endless wisdom to give in the most compassionate and beautiful forms. It's a temple for those who study and wish to accomplish a small fraction of the huge knowledge that exists not just on our planet but even beyond it. Wooden shelves, scarlet lights, smell of pages and the sound of turning them. Silence prevailing there makes even the whispers loud and stillness that makes the slightest moves prominent. This is all what makes a library different from any other place in the world. To a book lover, it feels like home where you could be all day and would still be left with a desire for more. Being in a library is a feeling that one cannot describe in words. And if I were to use the easiest form of language to explain it, I would just say that it is a feeling of being complete and satisfied to go. No matter what is going on outside the door, when you are in there, you are just in a physically small world, but still in an ocean of imagination and knowledge, probably larger than the physical world out there. You are inside sitting on a chair or maybe standing next to a shelf, moving your fingers over the smooth pages of a book in your hand with some other books lying near you, which you have grabbed and made a stack of in order to read them once you are finished with the one you are already reading. You are completely absorbed inside this book, understanding the subject from the viewpoint of the author. You may be inside the cell, looking at how it divides, or maybe in the operation theater, holding a pair of archery forceps ready to operate. You may be in the village with small kids taking their weights and heights, or looking inside the eye of an old man having a cataract. This is the beauty. You could be anywhere and everywhere when you are in the library. A library is also a place for socializing because when you need a small break from reading these endless books of medical sciences, you can just go out in the open garden with air brushing your cheeks and talk to your friends over a cup of coffee and share with them what you have read. Reading together in a library gives a sense of well-being, sharing and caring. It motivates us, keeps us on track and makes new bonds and strengthens old ones, moving together and succeeding together. When you spot a teacher in the library, you travel through time and realize that there are years ahead which you have to spend gathering knowledge and becoming more and more refined in your subject. The fastest thing in this entire universe is our mind. A library opens it up. It wakes up our dormant minds, brushes it and bathes it in a bubble bath with aroma candles all around. It clears the clouds of doubts so that our mind can fly without the slightest resistance. 
A library has books written by various authors who lived in different eras. It's like a variation on time and place, all clubbed together and kept in a library. If you are a person who already goes to the library, you know how it is adding to your mental wealth every time you enter its door. And if you have not been to a library, then try it once and you will never regret it. Get up, pack your bag and step forwards to make this change in your life now. Go to the library, to the reading room today to experience the joy of studying together.